Welcome everyone. I'm here today to talk about some microphone fixes for Apex Legend for Windows PC. Uh, I have a video already about how to pretty much turn on the microphone and all that. I'll link it at the end of the video if you want to check it out. This is going to be for specifically fixing for Windows if it's not working. So first thing we want to do is go down to where the speaker is and right click on it. And we'll go ahead and choose sounds first. Sounds will open here and then we're going to go ahead and fix if the microphone's not working, which would be the recording portion. So we click on the recording tab and then we would scroll to where your microphone is. So mine's a blue Yeti, so that's how it works. I'm going to have, I should have a check mark here. If you don't have a check mark on your microphone, you're going to want to right click on it. For example, if I went to my headset here, and you would choose set as default device and set as default communication device. This will make it so it works in game. It may already be set to default device, but it may not be set to communication device. So make sure you check that. This is for Windows 10 also. If you have Windows 10 and this stuff's not matching, you might want to go through and update it to make sure it's set up correctly for you. So that'll go ahead and fix the microphone. If you're having a problem with hearing as well, um, it would be the same thing with going into playback and you'd find like, for example, my headphones and you'd right click and do the same thing. Like if I clicked on this one, I would ha have set to default device and communication device for listening, which would be playback. But let's go ahead, just mainly worry about your microphone first. And as you talk, you should see these go up, basically showing that it's working. So once you have it set to default device and set to default communication device, we're gonna to go to another window. If this is correct, continue going through the video because there could be another step that you need to do. Go ahead and choose okay. Now we're gonna go back to the sound here and we're gonna go into open sound settings this time. It's gonna look a little different. We're under sound, and as I'm talking, you can see test your microphone is moving, so that's good. That means your default microphone for Windows is set correctly. So we'll scroll down a bit, and there's app volume and device preferences. Go ahead and click on that. This is gonna bring up other things that you use for voice chat you'll see origin as one. So you wanna make sure origin does have a volume of 100%. Also, I have it default default, so it's gonna use what my default Windows is using. If yours is not set that way and yours is not working, you could try setting it to default default. If it's already at default and it's not working at all, first you'd wanna go ahead and do output that's what you're hearing. So you would click on that and choose whatever is correct. For me, it would be the headphones. And then for input would be your microphone. So for me would be Blue Yeti. Keep in mind, if you have a microphone that's plugged into a headset, you may wanna go ahead and choose the headset for input and have them both. The best thing to do is try it, see if it works. If it doesn't, come back here and try again and just keep trying. Once you have those set, that's it. It should work for you if it was a Windows issue or if it was an issue in here. A lot of times it's this portion that is missed. So I hope this fixes it for you. If this fixed it, please let me know. Please drop a like and I will see you in the next one. Again, if you're just looking to turn your Apex sound on, I'll link a video up top here and smack out.